Hello, I'm Christine Van Slyk, Realtor with Remax Estate Properties. Thanks for tuning in to the June Market Update, where we look at what has happened in May compared to last year in four areas, Playa del Rey, Westchester, Culver City, and Playa Vista, where I sponsor the neighborhood websites. I also support clients in Greater LA, including beach cities and South Bay. So if you have specific areas in mind and want to see how they're performing, don't hesitate to reach out. Overall, we are seeing less inventory. Many homeowners are waiting or not interested in listing their homes due to their existing low mortgage rates. They're not willing to purchase another home at a much higher rate. This then makes it challenging for buyers out there. When the rates went up, the buyer demand slowed down a bit, but it's back up now. I think first time home buyers want to move out of their current higher rental environment and get more space. Also existing home buyers who want more space are willing to pay the higher rates and refinance later. I'm also seeing quite a few cash buyers where rates don't have a financial impact. Real estate is still a great investment. Given the lack of inventory and buyer demand, we are again seeing multiple offers with pricing going above asking. Overall, home prices are going up. All of these numbers can vary by neighborhood, so let's take a look at the four neighborhoods. So first of all, let's take a look at Playa del Rey. So total inventory over last year is basically flat. Total sales have gone up, not by tons, but it has gone up. The overall sales price has gone up. The median days on market has gone up and also the median price per square foot. Again, as you're looking at these numbers, just remember that it's both single family homes and condos. And so if you wanna have more specific information, you know, just reach out with respect to the type of uh, house or condo you're looking to purchase. Okay, the next one is Culver City, obviously a much larger population. Total inventory over last year has gone up quite a bit. Now the sales are down, but the median sales price is up. The median days on market is up, as well as the median price per square foot. Okay, and then the next one, uh, again, still large population, not as big as Culver City, but total inventory is 61, so it's up 27% from last year. Mind you, as you look at these, these include both the ones that are active as well as pending and active contract. So as an example for June, half of that would be active. So again, just looking, there, there really is not as much inventory as there was previously. Uh, the median sales price is about the same. It's gone up a little bit. Median days on market are 14, and the median uh, price per square foot has gone down. Again, part of these numbers are based on, you know, what sold, was it a larger house, smaller pricing? It's just a combination of these that gives this average. So again, if you need more information, don't hesitate to reach out. And then the last one is Playa Vista with the smallest population. Uh, right now, inventory is 31. And again, this is, we're looking at May. Uh, it's increased 158% over last year. The total sales are down, not by a lot, but they're down. The median sales price is down. And again, that just varies depending on the type of uh, the sale price. Uh, the median days on market has gone up and the median price per square foot has gone up as well. So what I'd like to do is also just share with you what one of the neighborhood websites look like. I'll have that information in my bio, but Playa Vista, for example, you can find the latest events that are taking place, the businesses in the area, information from myself, as well as the latest interviews with the business owners. So definitely worth taking a look, and we have that for Playa Vista, Playa del Rey, Westchester, and Culver City. Thanks again for tuning in to the latest update. Don't hesitate to reach out if you'd like more detailed info on those neighborhoods or any others in Greater LA, Beach Cities and South Bay. I'd love to help. My contact info is below. Thanks.